Okay, so in entrepreneurship, what we basically do is focus on things of like a broader perspective, you know, global market. So we're really in charge of, you know, impacting the community and setting our culture here at the school. So we're the trendsetters, basically. You know, it doesn't, you don't have to be in business to be an entrepreneur. You know, anyone can do it. We spot like what's big right now. So we'll look at it as like a global market. So right now we have a project with um, foods where we have the, um, we're sending a cookie recipe over to South Korea where they're on a whole health kick right now. So what we did is we teamed up with culinary to modify like, you know, our own cookie, you know, oatmeal raisin because they like it less sweet, so they came in here and so we taste tested it and things like that. The next generation of business owners are getting a jump on their careers in the entrepreneurship department at the Columbia Basin Technical Skills Center. Vance Frost heads the department, bringing nearly two decades of experience in marketing and branding with him and spent three years heading the Chief Academy Cafe at Moses Lake High School. The centerpiece of the curriculum is the design thinking model, which takes students through the entire process of a business relationship and product development. The model is currently used by business students at Stanford University. Frost also imparts practical wisdom on his students through informal discussions on business philosophy. We talked about this the other day. How long does it take to build a house? Months. Years. Months. How, many, how, how long does it take to burn down that house? Minutes. Hours. Yeah, minutes it comes down. So you guys can spend all that time developing those relationships. Now how easy it is to get flipped with somebody right before you leave. Sophomore Davin Donby is the first to admit he struggled through high school and became a student that teachers tend to write off. Joining the class and working with Frost has changed that in a good way. Oh yeah, I, I definitely was labeled as one of the people in the bad crowd. You know, I was the typical teenager with the long hair, basketball shorts, skater, you know, smoking pot, got a joint behind my ear. But uh, I really evolved from that more into a professional Thing, but I still have fun. I, I definitely think Mr. Frost has been a big part of my evolution and making me kind of where I am today from where I was last year. But I think I could have changed myself, just Mr. Frost was the person that really set me in motion for it. And I really thank for that. Senior Jocelyn Henriquez said what the class has learned through building better communication and relationship skills not only helps them, but is something they're passing on to those who will follow in their footsteps. We've been working with Chief Mo students. We've actually been helping kids that are slipping through the cracks. We've been trying to have sessions with them and trying to motivate them to do better in school. So we've been trying to connect with them. Basically what we do is We've all been there. We all try to connect with them, show them that they can do better and what it is going to help them to do better. In Moses Lake, Devin Higgins for iFiber One News.